If you're a homeowner and you love pets like I do, and you're thinking about selling your home, there are a few things that you should uh, think about, about pets and showings. Hi, this is Koshi, your Oh My Gosh Realtor with Keller Williams Realty in Spring, Texas. Remember, buyers and their agents need to feel a welcome to look at your house at their leisure without being in danger or having any other distractions. It doesn't matter what size, what breed, if it is trained or untrained, your dog needs to be placed in a crate or a kennel, or they have to be with a dog sitter, uh, uh, or you have to take them with you. Never leave them loose in your backyard. Remember, the buyers have to go out and check the yard, the size of the yard. They might need to take measurements of the yard. So always be considerate of your buyers. Although cats can be less threatening than a dog to strangers, cats can startle somebody just by being in the corner. Also, keep in mind the litter box, the cat litter box, it needs to be cleaned. You don't want people, buyers, uh, walking into seeing an uh, unclean, unpleasant sight. If you have uh, exotic birds, make sure you put a cover over their cage. You don't want them to be startled by the strangers or that's going to be, you don't want young children uh, sticking their fingers in to the cage and getting a surprise bite. And I hope these things will help you in deciding and to make it a pleasant uh, selling experience for you. Remember, always think about the buyers as well as your own safety and your own liability. I hope this helps you out. Thank you.